Hi guys, my name is Patricia, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a video showing you how to get my natural look, just the way I look on an everyday basis. So if you want to know how I do that, just keep on watching. I'm just going to jump right in and um, I've already prepped my face, so I'm just going to go right in and use the One Heck of a Block from Soap and Glory. Next I'm going to use my foundation and that is the Bourjois Healthy Mix. Looks, And I'm just going to blot it all over my face. And just blend that in. The thing about foundation, I don't like using lots and lots for like um, every day. So next I am going to go in with some concealer. And the one that I'm using today is the Bare Mineral Stroke of Light. And I'm just going to put some under my eyes, a little bit on my forehead, and a little bit on my chin. Just go like this. A little bit on my forehead. And down the bridge of my nose. And just a little bit on my chin. Um, I really like this concealer because it's actually really really light, um, it's not very thick. Then once I am happy with that I go in and I powder everything in. Um, the one I'm using is the NYX Finishing Powder, this one, and that is in the shade Banana. I'm going to go in with a bronzing powder from Bourjois, and this is the chocolate one, so it looks like that. And this is in the shade 51. I am not going to attempt saying the name of this shade because my French isn't great. So I'm just going to leave it out there. Eyebrows. Now with my eyebrows, um, realistically on a day-to-day -day basis, I actually leave them like this. I just give them a little brush. So with a spoolie like this. I just and honestly I just brush them and that is it um, but when I'm feeling like they're not looking very good or I just want to look a little bit more presentable I will go ahead and fill them in uh, I have no idea what this is called I'm actually not sure but it just has literally it has a spoolie it has a spoolie on this side and then on the other side it has like a Pencil, should I say? And I'll kind of draw where I want it to start and finish. This is very difficult to explain. Um, but um, I just I just um, go with little tiny strokes to make it look as natural as I possibly can. So the mascara that I use is the Maybelline Lash Sensational and I use that in Extra Noir, so Extra Black, that wasn't too bad for French and I love, love this mascara, I love the brush and I think this is the perfect brush to make your lashes look the biggest they could possibly be. Um, this is literally my all-time favourite mascara. 
also I think this angle I, I don't think I'm the only one that does this but this angle really helps to get right from the bottom of your lash to right to the tip of your lash I'm sorry my camera totally cut me off there I don't know what happened anyway um, I'm just gonna tell you what happened since then I um, completed my eyes so I put my mascara on my top lashes and a little bit on my bottom lashes and I also went ahead and used a little bit of highlighter for the inner corners of my eyes just to brighten them a little bit I also went ahead and I used one of the highlighters from the uh, Revolution Revolution um, Ultra Blush palette so it is this one and it is the um, golden sugar one this one right here uh, so that's what I did so now I'm just going to go ahead and finish it all off with some lipstick so I am actually going to use the Maybelline the Gigi Hadrid one and then I'm going to use the um, lipstick to finish it off this is a really nudie colour um, that really looks natural and I'm going to go ahead and use the lipstick I forgot to tell you the shade this is in the shade McCall so that is it guys I think this makeup looks really really natural and it's really nothing special but um, I think it does the trick so if you enjoyed that please give me a thumbs up uh, subscribe thank you guys so much and I'll see you on my next video my foundation and this is one of the foundations of my face. You think this is a hot drink, but it's actually water. <laughs>